Hi Gemini, welcome to my channel. This is a special love tarot reading session for you, Gemini. Okay. This reading for today, Gemini, is the current feelings of your person. I hope you're well, Gemini. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. Okay. This reading for today is for the Gemini friends out there. What can I get for Gemini, please? What is the love message that is meant for you to know? And ready for you to know this is applicable for singles couples in a relationship dating and getting to know this is the current feelings of your person this is for you Gemini okay let's see what's coming towards you if you are a guest viewers please don't forget to click the bell and click subscribe and if you would like to further connect with connect with me you know what to do all of the details about the private reading extended reading the merch is down the description box below all right so let's start your reading okay so the first reading is that you're dealing with someone who's very busy they have this active lifestyle active lifestyle very busy very entrepreneurship uh for some of you they're on call 25 24 by 7 very busy the full card um the prince of swords the ten of wands i feel like you're dealing with someone who's very busy you you have the suspicion that oh maybe they have a third party or maybe this person is is intentionally confusing me i feel like you're confused okay i, I don't i don't think this is an ex this is not an ex okay this is someone you dated probably on and off you could still be talking to this person right now or recently pretty much august month for some of you um they really want to get to know you and move forward, but they just don't have time. And if you are a bit clingy or a little bit, you know, wanting to talk all the time, a little bit possessive, they aren't like that. You know, they, they are more of quality versus quantity. Um, They don't have time. You know, my current feelings is that, you know, I would like to take a risk with you, but there's so many competing priority. In a page of swords in reverse you know like they would have ten of wands I'm, I'm getting in here that the only time they've got is sleep sleeping you know they they're even behind their household chores eight of pentacles the full card you're dealing with someone who's very busy career or business eight of pentacles the full card i mean they would love to have you consistently like officiated but they just don't have time that's it um ten of wands like you, you you know you felt like replying responding that's so basic and yet they cannot give it to you they're annoyed you know if they would text you um like this person is very dedicated, like Page of Swords in reverse. When 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 they are one on one with someone or if they will text you, they will make sure that if they will be available. You know, at some point this person will text you and eat at the same time. So whenever they text you, they are really available. When they call you, they are really available. Their quality over over quantity. Hopefully their schedule would change because I feel like it's getting into them, you know, 10 of wands in reverse. I don't think they're happy with their schedule. I don't think ha they're happy with how busy they are. I think, I don't know, maybe this is an architect, an engineer. There's a lot of drawing in here, artistic as well. But I, they would definitely do something with their schedule, with this business, something to do with, you know, being workaholic. They, they are aware of that. They're going to do something. And hopefully when they do something, you're still going to be there. Because, you know, their loyalty is, I feel like this person is very loyal. It's just that they're so busy. I'm getting the same message. Very busy. And I think you are aware of that. So that's their current feelings is that I'm so busy. I think about you, but I'm so busy. Okay. All right. Next reading. You got a King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and Energy. Ten of Cups. Oh, wow. This is an X. Oh, wow. Empress card. And a four of wands. You've got an ex. You have an ex who would like to reconcile with you. Who would like to start all over again. I feel like this person is building the momentum. King of Cups, Ten of Cups. 
the reminiscing like when when this person thinks about you is that you are jackpot okay yeah like you are the one this is the one exactly you know you're the one empress card you are my empress you are the one for me gemini but i'm a bit experiment ex they're experimenting you know like if i look at the queen the king of cups the way he holds the cup is up here and then he looks his gaze towards me so it is as if this person is exploring is there is there something else out there that he could be very playful i don't know how you break up or if you're still together but um they're trying to test the water but they could not they could not <laughs> they could not find you know they've they've they've, com they've they've compared you your relationship like if you're you you and your relationship is still the one okay and i feel like this person will give up will give up the looking for something outside of your connection or relationship they will give up sometimes people we tend to lose people only to find out that all along what they're looking is just within you know four of wands within this this is you know this is where you stand and they stand you know they're looking outside of this wall and then every time they look every time they look they keep coming back to this because this is home base you know they are going to realize that the happiness is you happiness is you definitely i don't think it's going to happen overnight i don't think it's going to happen overnight but you've got an ex who keeps coming back on and off trust me they will i think attempt to look two three times after that you know they feel like most especially if you are in the mid 30s going to 40s this person would settle um it is a feeling where this person is in like a it's it's like lost in a midlife crisis and trying to experiment what else outside of you could make them happy or they would be able to connect it is as if this person i went through this stage you know to be honest with you Gemini, I, I went through this stage where i feel like i needed something new i'm looking for something only to find out whatever i'm looking was inside of me or was in was within my family or friends you know but it made me whole like i need to make a mistake and it made me whole so i think i feel like this person it they're going through this this is an ex they would be they know by now that home and heart belongs to you they will yeah they will find their way home back to you this is an ex you probably have kids together for some of you you dated are around 20s or maybe high school sweetheart but i see you growing old together hmm. yeah so this is a good one it was deep that was deep gemini okay let's pick up more intuitive message for you okay what is the current feelings of your person? Okay. What is the current feelings of your person? You got a page of wands in reverse. The devil card. Okay, could be a Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Queen of Pentacles. I feel like this is, you know, this third reading, it is a applicable. It's applicable, Gemini, if you had that messy fight or messy breakup. Okay, messy fight, messy breakup. So how would they feel towards you? Queen of Pentacles, the Eight of Wands. Um, they're still upset, but they're in the process of detaching from being upset. Or because the devil card in reverse, this is if they don't text you or call you, Queen of Pentacles, they're still acting, I don't care. Or they're still acting aloof or not ready to talk. But that's good because the space that you have provided with one another, it makes them feel, <clears throat> um, you know, devil card, it's, <clears throat> excuse me, they're like, it's, it's time to clean up. It's time to clean up. It's time to move on. Okay. So I feel like it's, it's going to get better. Um, sometime, I feel like within four weeks from now, you're going to get an update with them. Don't expect too much. I feel like they would try to feel if things are okay. Like if you could, you could be friends. I think, you know, for 
within within four weeks from now, four eight weeks from now, they'll return and they'll check up on you and see if you could be friends. I'm hearing the word that the you know the pain or the hurt or the disappointment you cause one another. It's 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 deep. It's deep. Okay, but they do. I feel like four weeks, four four to eight weeks, um, most especially around the end of this year, because uh, maybe it's Christmas time. Like they would not allow the year to end without being okay with you. You know. So yeah, they're still you. You are still important with them, even though they're hurting or disappointed, or even though you're fighting, you're still interested with them. You, you break up with this person. This is not a current relationship. Okay? So, take it easy. This is your reading. Thank you. And connect with me. All of the details down in the description box below. I will see you soon. You have a great day. Bye-bye.